Hey, and I'm Adam. And we're part of the Movie Preview Review Podcast, where we review movies based on only watching their previews. And today we're going to react, review, and riff off of a trailer for a movie that I had no idea was coming out. Me it's neither. It's a property I've never heard of. I don't even know what he's talking about. But people are really excited about this. Uh, it's based off of an anime. What? Yep. It's done by James Cameron and Robert Rodriguez, who are both very good at their craft. Okay. It's called Alita Battle Angel. I don't know what this is. Okay! Yeah, we're going in blind. Woo! Somebody in the comments said, oh my god, please do this movie, and go in blind. So, yeah. we kind Here of we are. Go. Here All we right. Boop. 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 Sound effects this time. Yeah, man. Yep. High tech. Boop. <laughs> Whoa! Whoa! Oh, you. May your dreams bring you peace in the darkness. May you always This is just a body. It's not bad or good. That part's up to you. I don't mean to be rude, but am I supposed to know you? Actually, we just met. It's a harsh world. A strong prayer on the weak down here. completely human. And we'll never I'd do whatever I had to for you. I'd give you whatever I have. I'd give you my heart. Alida, they will come for you. Why? I think you are someone Guys, ho, ho, ho! Yeah, it's like an early Christmas present. What? I what? This looks awesome. Yeah. That looks amazing. Holy crap! This is exactly what James Cameron should be doing. Yes. You know what I mean? Unlo but instead of other projects. No, like, he, there is no doubt that Cameron will like him or love him or hate him. Like when it comes to visual effects, like he's the pioneer. He's the guy. And working with Del Toro, like this is like Rodriguez. Rodriguez, sorry. Wow, yep. different one. Sorry, I, I, sorry. There, the I got him. I got him. Ooh, ooh, that looks rad. Yes. So let's let's talk about the elephant in the room. Okay. Hmm. Them some eyes. She, she is. Let's be honest. She is up here. She is definitely up here. It's a little weird. I kind of... It was upsetting for like the first like 20 seconds. Yeah. And then for some but reason, it, it felt... I got used to it like that. I was like, okay. Yeah, she's like an anime character. Done. It makes sense that like they would make robots that kind of look like anime characters. Yeah. Well, Pop culturally. So that's what I was going to get to. In that, uh, yeah, I got used to it by the end of the trailer as well. But there is that weird type of like... Uncanny Valley. Uncanny Valley, but also like having anime or animation proportions in real life don't work. You know what I'm saying? Like, oh, a Barbie doll is hot, but sure. I'm like an actual woman is like, be oh like, god. Ah! Ah! But like, so like anime, like I I enjoy anime very much, but like seeing anime sized, or I think that'd be like a good hybrid. But like sure. anime sized eyes on an actual human is like, oh Jesus! Yeah, something's like, wrong! Mm, something's wrong! Yeah, something's wrong! Something's wrong! But once you can, <laughs> once I connect with the fact that she's a robot, I'm like, no, okay, yeah, yeah, I was in. It, I got over it immediately. The first the first five seconds that were a little disturbing. Mm -hmm. She's first like, do I know you? I'm like, <laughs> I hope not. I <laughs> hope not. Oh, uh, also the, the just, yeah, I don't know anything about it, and I just want to go. Good trailer. Yeah. Uh, well, we, we, this is what we know. 
Cyborgs are all over the place. All oh, they're everywhere. Just who's not a cyborg? Cyborgery. <laughs> so much cyborgery. Woo! Uh, and they are bad guys, and she is badass and awesome. And that's pretty much all you really need, because she's gonna kick some ass. Yeah, that's all you need. Mm-hmm. We're good. Like we got, we nailed it. If you if you had to have a cybernetic implant, like if you had to change add robots to your body in one way, how do how would you do it? Well, tactically, Jay, I was expecting you to ask that question. Oh, you were? Yeah, I was. Uh, actually, technically, I'm a cyborg right now. Go on. Because I have contacts in. Technically speaking, I'm a cyborg. Glasses are technically technology you wear. Technically, cyborg. I'm a super nerd. But to answer your Boring. actual question, to answer your actual question, I am bored by your <laughs> answer. Sorry. <laughs> Not sufficient, sir. Uh, I was looking for something fanciful. Like I, limbs. I, you know what? Let me let me let me be completely honest. Anything it takes to keep me alive. Okay. Yep. So you want like a robot heart? Is what you're saying? <clears throat> if that's what it takes. Or you want nanobites that like that keep your body regenerating cells? Sure. Okay. I'll, I'll take whatever they got to keep this guy going. So you want to be immortal, is basically what you're saying. Yes. And if I also get upgrades where I can kick a lot of ass, like, I don't want, like, that one robot in there that was seemed like more of a tank thing and was, like, shooting out, like, tentacles from its arm. I don't want that. But, like, I would be more of a... I would want to be more of, a, like, a, a robot that could scrap. Because okay. Because as a human, I can't scrap. And so you I want, like, like power fists kind of situation? Yeah. Like that. <laughs> Pow! Kind of thing. Yeah. See? Maybe like a knife hand? Um, I'm going Doc Ock, like, hard. I just want... Poosh, poosh. I want to be able to, like, walk around on them. <laughs> yeah, man. I just want... Clamp, 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 clamp. I want the clamps. Give me the clamps. Dude, you're telling me that you if you saw me walking around like... He wouldn't be like, yeah, that, makes, yeah, that, that tracks. I'd be, like, funny with him. <laughs> He'd probably be pulling practical jokes. Yeah, like pulling pranks. Being like, like, you know, like uh, oh, is this a quarter behind your ear? And like, I, I like reach with like my regular hand, but I don't pull anything. They're like, oh, that's a terrible magic trick. And I'm like, oh, well, what about this? And then it's just all the coins. It's just, yeah, be awesome. <laughs> well, learn how to juggle with them. Come on, that'd be cool. Ah, oh, be the life of the party. Be like shaking drinks with it. Like, oh, what can I get you? Like, oh, I got a Manhattan up here, and I got like a kind of. Uh, martini over here. What do you want? Ba, da, da, ba. Like flair bartending with my yeah, with, with cocktail my, with my clock with my with my Doc Ock arms. I feel like I have a, a, a an ingenious business proposal for the future. Uh, cyborgs are right around the corner. Right around the corner. And in this so movie, close in this movie, and also what Jay wants uh, are tentacles. Yeah. I don't think that's weird. I, I, I'm not saying that it's weird. I'm I saying it's prevalent. I think I think you're racist against. I am not. Robo tentacles. Wait, wait for my pitch. Robo cephalopods. I'm are... saying that since uh, robot tentacles are prevalent everywhere, people want them. People, they're in robots all over the place. Okay. They're in pop culture. Okay, I'm yeah. saying that we should open Adam and Jay's robot tentacle emporium. Come on down, to Adam and Jay's robot emporium. You want tentacles? You want clampers? We got some. We got we got aluminum. We got steel. We got carbon resin. We even got steampunk. We got plastic. You got to power them with water, but they work just fine. Come on down. Come on down. In legs, in arms, in torsos. You had a body. We'll put tentacles in it. Have you ever thought to yourself, hey, maybe I'm an octopus? Come on down. We'll hook you up. Hey, have you ever thought to yourself, man, that friendly neighborhood Spider-Man's getting a little too cheeky, and you want to crush him to death with robotic arms? Come on down. How many arms can you buy support? We'll find out. <laughs> Come on down. How much How much robotics can your tiny frame fit? <laughs> we have specialists to figure out just how many robot tentacles your body can control without you going insane. <laughs> and for this holiday season, it's buy one, get one free. That's right. I have too many robotic arms. That means my brain, my brain function has completely gone. I'm crazy. I'm giving these things away. <laughs> <laughs> like there'd be four arms. Come on down! <laughs> Come on down! Come on down! <laughs>
And instead, of, like, yeah, and and the big, like, the big yeah. inflatable man also has it's robotic on. arms, like, <laughs> <laughs> just a just a very furiously it's flailing, just arms. it's and just clamping. Arms. Just, <laughs> it's like, no, don't get too close to the big inflatable man. He will go clamp you. Ooh. Oh. <laughs> Well, we're definitely going to do this one on the podcast. Oh, yeah. yeah. And this one, I think, is a good blending of a little bit of sci-fi, but good action that uh, the rest of the gang will enjoy. Yeah, totally. Uh, well, what's that podcast, Adam? It's the Movie Preview Review Podcast. Doc, uh, the link button? Go, go! Uh, on our podcast, we interview comedians and writers and actors and directors yeah. and roboticists and... Engineering mechanical people, yeah. mechanical engineers, yeah, and uh, super villains, super villains, uh, good guys who amputated. So then now they have like Winter Soldier because he's yeah. got technically he's got a mechanical mechanical arm. Yeah, uh, all sorts of cool people. We come on the podcast, we talk about the careers and the cool bionics. We watch movie trailers, then make fun of them. We sure do. Uh, it's a lot of fun. Uh, some of them, I think this is probably one of our better ones. Uh, but it's kind of like, exactly like this, where you come up with crazy stuff, and then we just riff for a while. Yeah. Uh, guys, please let us know more about this movie, because we don't we know, don't know anything about this IP. Yeah, we want to know. So please let us know. Uh, if I mean, this is an anime, I, where is it? I have never heard of yeah, it Yeah, well, I would like to go to there. Uh, so please let us know. Uh, yeah, give us all the information. Other videos are popping up right in front of you right now. We really appreciate you guys watching, and we'll check you out, guys, next time. Bye. Bye.